Our police spokesperson told the 11 News I team that 16 year old Darius Bratney may have been killed during a video production where real guns were used. In a media update sent out by police earlier tonight, they classify Bratney's death as a pending case. The 300 block of McMeckin Street is where Darius Bratney's life came to a sudden end. The 16 year old was found in the hallway of an apartment building with a gunshot wound. My heart is broken. Bratney is being remembered by friends and family on social media, many using the hashtag RIP Darius, including Kwame Rose, who says he mentored the teen. One of the main reasons I connected with Darius is that my first name is Darius and I realized he was going through the same kind of some of the same problems I was going through through middle school. Rose says he started mentoring Bradney in 2013 and says the teen was a promising athlete. One of the things that Darius is known for is being an excellent basketball player. Do I think that Darius could have been a, a, a full scholarship player for basketball whether or not he his death happened Friday or not? I think so. The shooting that killed Bradney is under investigation, but police say evidence points to the probability that the incident was an accident. Friends and family plan to gather Tuesday evening outside the place where Bradney's life was cut short to remember the teen. And that vigil will be held at 6 o'clock tomorrow in the 300 block of McMeckin Street. Reporting live from Baltimore Police Headquarters, Vanessa Herring, WBAL TV 11 News.